are here at Crawford Lake today. Behind me, you will see the long houses. It was a village for early settlers back in the history. Ayan has some more like, uh, knowledge about that. I'll show it to him so that he can describe. Um, I just went from here all the way. Yeah. And I just came back because I want to go down. Do you want to talk about the, uh, the how long house is behind us? Oh, yeah, sure. So, there, the top bunk used to be used for storing items. Oh. And the bottom used to sleep. And then, the way that prevented me to not go rotten, they used to put salt on it. Mm. And then, after when they want to eat it, they uh, roast it, and then they eat it. And voila, and then, the meat is ready to yeah. eat. So, uh, he's talking about his social studies lesson, which he studied in class. Actually, we're done that period. Now we're doing... We, there are actually uh, two or three tribes. Hmm. The Ana the the Anishina Ana Anishinaabe Anishinaabe yeah. and the Wendat. Yeah. Those are the two tribes we learned okay. in social studies. Okay. Yeah, and we did this virtual field trip around here in the summer. Yeah, yeah, actually they were supposed to be coming here with the school, but then uh, since COVID was here, so they couldn't travel here. So right now we are here. We're going to go there. First of all, we're going to see the Crawford Lake, which might be just frozen right now. So let's go see the lake first. Woo! And then we'll go to the lake. Uh, sorry, Long to the long houses. houses. Yeah, we'll show you how. I can't is. wait. Less people behind me now. Crowd has moved that way. Hey! Wow! Looks yes, darling. Amazing. Does it look nice to you? Yeah. Let's see what it says. Oh my god, people can walk on it. Yep. Can you remove your hat? the boardwalk it was so beautiful you know one side was a frozen lake and the other side was this wilderness my phone died and I have to I had to borrow from my husband the jungle is long and we are straight going to the parking and we will also look at the long houses before we leave home yeah and there my son is We lost our way and we took out the trail and we were kind of lost. I'm sad that I, my phone died, you know, on the way to the boardwalk. I should have shown you more. It was very beautiful. I couldn't take a picture of myself too because of that. Now we're going to the long houses and we're going to show you how it is inside and how the early settlers lived back in the time. These are the long houses. Early settlers built it for themselves and they actually lived here. I'm taking you inside to show you what they had inside. Oh, it seems like the long houses have been closed because of the COVID situation and people don't want you know, to gather inside. So to tell you a little bit about these long houses, these long houses were built back in the time by early settlers. Iraq, when I think these are the people <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm so sorry if I made a mistake. So they made the house like inside with the bunk. And then the lower bunk they used to sleep in. And the upper bunk they used to put their stuff like their food and clothing and all. They used to wear the animal fur. And then they, and like Ayan was saying, they used to keep the extra meat to marinate with salt and then they hung it up somewhere 
so that they could use it later. So this is the history. I am really proud that we live in Milton and this is like so close for us. There is another trail that goes from here to straight to Rattlesnake Park, uh, right from Crawford Lake. But that, uh, that one has to be shut down as well this season. I am sorry that I couldn't show you those, uh, you know, the boardwalk more. Uh, so far, so good. I'm so tired. I'm wearing, you know, the jacket and the winter gear, including the winter pants today because it's minus 15. So I am, I can see I have shortness of breath right now. So with this, I will just say bye to you guys and uh, let's meet again uh, on our next trip to one of the Milton Park hiking. Thank you so much. Thank you for watching, guys. This was Crawford Lake Conservation Area, Horton Hills. Peace out.